procedure that we use to treat Parkinson's disease is deep brain stimulation. It's like placing a pacemaker inside the brain. So just like your heart can beat irregularly, we have to set that regular rhythm. Well, the brain signals are often uh, deranged uh, in, in Parkinson's disease and other neurodegenerative disorders. And what the stimulator does is it doesn't destroy tissue. It actually gives an electrical signal which then reorganizes the disorganized firing and the symptoms then improve. In fact, it's quite instantaneous in Parkinson's disease. We can actually see the tremor go away right on the operating room table because the patient's awake for the surgery. The difference in this procedure other than the other 800 deep brain stimulation procedures I had done previously is that this was the first time this new device was being used um, uh, in the East Coast for sure, and I believe um, the first time it had been placed using the technique that I use, which is what we call a frameless deep brain stimulation implantation. It now offers stimulation that we can actually direct and steer the current inside the brain. Well now when we place the lead, and it's still very precise, our target's only five millimeters in length, that we can then steer the current to improve the symptoms with lower battery use or improve the symptoms without getting any side effect. So uh, we programmed his stimulator and his tremor went away uh, immediately um, and he was able to walk more uh, briskly, able to move more briskly. He was clearly, he had a big smile on his face when he left because it's the first time he had had no tremor in four or five years. Uh, and he'll probably be able to reduce the amount of medicine he's taking as well. Uh, and this will help him with his social life, it'll help him with his professional life. So this was a real liberating experience for him.